Welcome back to Sports Night. Located in the Cedar Valley is one organization that is getting kids active with horseback riding program. But this is no ordinary program. This week, my co-host Shelby Gunrath goes inside the numbers with what Aspire means to some people. If you are driving down Kimball Avenue in Waterloo, you may drive by Aspire. You will see a number of horses roaming around in the fields and cars coming and going. You would probably assume it's a place for people to experience horseback riding. You would be right, but there's much more to it than that. Here at Aspire, these may look like normal horses, but they are actually a lot different. Bo here is trained to be a therapeutic riding horse. The Aspire Therapeutic Horseback Riding Program provides services to individuals with disabilities through animal-assisted activities and outreach programs. Basically, we teach individuals with disabilities how to ride horses. Marilyn explained that a horse is similar to a human. So when an individual with disabilities who may not be able to walk rides a horse, the horse mimics how it should feel to walk or sit. So it relaxes the muscles and then it begins to change the signals in the brain to tell you this is how it's supposed to look to walk. This is how it looks to sit. So it touches every single muscle from the top of your head to the bottom of your toes. Deborah Leisinger has been bringing her 18-year-old son Andrew to Aspire for almost six years now. Keep going. Good job. Whoa. Andrew is considered mentally handicapped, but the Aspire program has provided him with a number of benefits. It has helped his balance. He has gotten stronger through his torso and his leg muscles and arm muscles have also benefited from it. Um, his balance is a lot better, his flexibility, so, and even his fine motor skills have gotten better. Andrew is not the only individual who has benefited from the program. We've seen kids that absolutely couldn't walk with only just assistance of a walker, not at all in a wheelchair, and, and begin to take steps. Um, one little boy walked 27 steps just after eight weeks of lessons. The Aspire program is very important for families with children who have disabilities. Leisinger said it means a lot to her because of how much her son loves it. He looks so forward to it. He counts down the days till Wednesday gets here. He hates for November to get here because then the program ends for the winter. Marilyn expressed that the most rewarding part about what she does is seeing the changes in the people they help. Sometimes it's those small therapeutic moments that you, you understand that we've had a breakthrough um, with them, and so it's, it's really nice. With November approaching, Andrew and the other riders will be finishing up their fall classes and looking forward to April when they can saddle up again. Reporting for Sports Night, I'm Shelby Grenath.